Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The Tasks folder helps you organize and manage your workload. It keeps track of any tasks that you have to complete and reminds you when they are due. You can also use tasks to assign work to colleagues. In this lesson, we will explore how you can use this feature to assign tasks to yourself and others in order to manage your workload. You can open the Tasks folder by clicking the Tasks button within the navigation bar. If you click the Folders button within the navigation bar, note that you can also view the Tasks folder by clicking the Tasks folder within the Folder pane to display it that way as well. By default, Outlook displays tasks within the Tasks folder using the To-Do List view. Tasks are listed in a pane down the screen by due date. You can click the actual Tasks icon that's shown in the folder pane in order to see the Tasks folder shown in the Simple List view if you prefer. In the Simple List view, the tasks appear as a traditional list that you can check off as you complete them. Overdue tasks are displayed in red and completed tasks are shown with a strike through. Each task has a checkbox to its left that you can click to check when you have completed the task. This will not delete the task from the list, but simply strikes it out so that you can tell it has been accomplished. You would have to select a task that you wish to delete, and then press the Delete key on your keyboard to remove the task from the list and send it to the Deleted Items folder. To view the details of a task that you have placed into your Tasks folder, double-click on the Required Task and the Task window will appear. Once you have finished viewing the details of the task, you can close it by clicking the X in the upper right corner of the task window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.